In this video, we're going to show you how to make professional looking flyers on Photoshop. All right. So what you want to do is, especially if you're not part of an agency, you're a freelancer and you want to have preset default templates, just type in flyer template Photoshop free. Very easy. Google. There's a lot of things you can do here. Some are uh, quote unquote free. Some websites are, are quote unquote free, but they're really not. They're just going to offer like a 30 day free trial. But whatever templates you do get there are free and can be used by you since it's within the trial period. But let's just say, let's go to like this website, elegantflyer.com. It has thousands of free templates that you can use for Photoshop, which is, as you can see, there's a lot of different, like really good looking flyers here, right? So it, there are different types. You have business, you have club and parties, and this seems to be club and parties or events. Color and style community flyers, food and drink, seasonal flyers, sports flyers. So, you know, if you're you're a business, just go to business flyers and like look for maybe, you know, a barber and you're going to be shown, you know, these amazing looking flyers for, you know, a barber ad or flyer that you can, you know, print and 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 spread around to people to just to give more exposure to your business. And it's very easy. So you, all you need to do uh is just click on like for example you want to use this one and as you can see there's premium download and then uh oh this is a premium one okay so anyway there are free ones you can see free this is free this is premium uh the green ones are free there are yellow ones are premium with a crown in it so let's let's just get this free one you can see it's free and you're gonna see go premium or free download just click on free download Right, and your download's gonna start in like 10 seconds, so let's just wait. I'm just showing you the uh the method on just down downloading this. As you can see, it's downloading. And this is just three two hundred and ninety under three hundred MB, but it's very slow. Uh, I'm having issues with my internet, but even so, this should be this only should take like not even 40 seconds, but a lot of traffic, I guess. So all right, once you've downloaded this, right? Once you've downloaded this, you're going to be shown uh this 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 uh zipped file, right? So all you need to do is just you know, open it and just click on this and open it on your uh Photoshop. I've already pre-downloaded this for an example, and it's going to be like this. This is this is pretty much it. So, I'm going to show you the the thing that I downloaded. Where is it? As you can see, this is what I downloaded. Look at this, right? See, it's the same thing. And the good thing about this is you could change this to whatever you want for whatever utility or need that you want. Because, you know, if you want a QR code, you can, you know, put a new one. So this is every element is different. As you can see here, the background that's, you know, very low opacity is different. This cross, this Good Friday icon is different. Is a separate entity. This, this, these texts are separate entities, right? These ones are also separate entities. So it's very easy to just mix and match. And as you can see here, you know, you know, if you're a graphic designer uh, or a starting one, this is a great way to just, you know, this is a great website. There's a lot of new ones. So yeah. Just, just, just do this and, and, you know, mix and match. Like what I said, change fonts, change the elements, but, you know, have the same effect. And yeah, that's pretty much it. That's the video. Hope you liked it. Like, comment, share, subscribe, and that way I can see you on the next one.